camera. Are we on live right now? We're on live. Okay, we're still live. We're live? We are live. We are live. Oh. Well, hello, world. <laughs> we have 530 yeah. people yeah. with us. We have 660, okay. 700 people okay. with us. I'll try. Um, the only problem is, is that it's really loud, so I can't hear shit. You hear this? <laughs> oh, yes. yeah. Okay, nobody, <laughs> nobody talk and just play music so it doesn't cut out. After that, oh, yes, should we, we pop some bottles? Hey, guys, we got season yes. two. I don't have, Woo! we did it, too, guys. We're we we're did it. <laughs> Instagram live. It's still late. Yeah, so you're going to bed. <laughs> it's okay. 1 p.m. here Wait, and I'm uh, drinking already. Where you now? No. I'm about to pop this. Okay, everybody go. Champagne. <laughs> everybody oh, say, okay. what's the time okay. zone right now? What's all oh. of your time zones right now? Okay, oh, start yeah, with okay. Jess. Oh, what? Uh -oh. Who wants to make the toast? What? Uh, you. Yeah, you. Okay. you. You do it. You make the toast. You do. and journeys, celebrating those things that make us women, those things that make us bond with everything that is enthralled in that. It has been a true honor. It has been a true blessing. Thank you to Elliot Lawrence, the man who understood that women need to roar like we do in this show. Here he is. <laughs> Woo! For being so, <laughs> so welcoming and making this family truly generational, truly multi-ethnic, and truly representative of everybody. I love you here, all. Here, here. I love I you. you. Cheers. Love you guys. Woohoo! Here, here. I love you too. Cheers. Hey, Cheers to Motherland season two. Woohoo! Woo Congratulations. Congratulations, Bye. you beautiful Congrats. girls. Congrats. Oh, okay. What I wanted to know, <laughs> everyone say your time zone right now. What time is it where you are, Jess? Okay, right now, it is 
10 p.m. It's 10 p.m. Amalia, what time is it where you are? Oh, we're frozen. <laughs> Guys, oh, there we go. Okay, Amalia, what time is it where you are? So, okay, so oh, it's two hours. Yes, it's 10 for me and Lynn. Yeah. 10 for you and okay. Lynn. Yeah. 10 p.m.? So, so 2.58. Yeah, 3 p.m. Wait, so the, yeah, are they, are Amalia and Lynn are yeah. 10 p.m.? Yeah, 10 as well, 10 p.m., yeah. Okay, and Ash? 3. 3 p.m.? Demetria? Uh, 4 p.m. <laughs> it is 1 p.m. where I am. Probably the most unacceptable time to drink, but, um. <laughs> but actually, okay. yes, I'm <laughs> celebrating. Hasn't Why stopped me that? before, so now I have an, uh, an actual reason to justify my my day glass of wine. Yes. <laughs> 5 p.m. somewhere, baby. It's never too it's early true. to drink. And um, <laughs> as your general, I just want to congratulate my, uh, you know, recruits and my unit and my uh, right hand, Anacostia. It has been an honor to serve alongside you. It has been an honor to have you as my team. And I cannot wait for what's to come in season two. No it's it's gonna get it's gonna be real. It's gonna, get real. It's gonna be oh, amazing. Oh my god! And uh, Lynn, to those you, to those on our Instagram me, live, uh, Lynn is now joining as a, a series regular. <laughs> You're so. free operative. Congrats, to her. Uh, girl. I mean, we can't give it away. What's happening tomorrow in the finale? But yeah, well, um, yeah. You know, you 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 all gonna have to tune in and watch it tomorrow. But sweetheart. Off screen, I love you so much as I love all of you. Uh, okay. You know, but on screen, yeah, I'm not your. <laughs> you're not my favorite. Can, can, can we please take like dibs, bets? What's gonna happen in season two? Because wait, uh, but Elliot was like the only thing that he signed off. Like, what? No, a little bit. We know. Yeah, we are. We can okay, answer okay, questions okay. if you guys want to. Sure because because Jess is like, can we take bets on season two? What is going to happen? I'm about <laughs> We're to on live. We well, know a little I bit. I don't actually. I don't know. I don't know anything. So I'm just like okay. thinking. I kind of what I'm hoping for is maybe to experience more off base. Since my character is a blaster, I want to know about when I'm going to blast some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> where, where, yeah. I'm also very, very, very curious as to General Alder's storyline. And, um, and that ties into yours, Demetria, yeah. because, you know, they're so very closely linked. works hand in hand with the spree because if you neutralize the threat then you have nothing to fight for and you lose your power right so to kind of give yourself yeah. something to always work towards yeah and, and keep your power you kind of have control and say in the spree but um you know it's uh i don't know i just thought that was such an interesting, interesting point of view yeah it's well, like but with, but with, the possibility, with the possibility of this um new emerging threat that there may you know be kind of looming in the in the air you know maybe that gives some more credence to what you're talking about yeah I, I, that's what we said we're like it could be it could be anything or maybe in season two she feels that she's losing her power and so she creates an enemy or or becomes the enemy or you know something I, something i have like. a question that's been that's been bugging me is a dodger one of the powers of like necro Uh, 
that not as um mm -hmm. a specific power? Uh, power. power. Um, yes. it's not a it's not a power, but it's um it's like it's a skill, I guess. Um, a people. <laughs> yeah. They decide to live like that and they run for their entire lives and they just move from family to like refugee. Yeah. I have a question. Yeah. Can you just to smoke? So like so like okay, so she's a knower, she's a blaster, she's a healer, you're a shift changing neck. <laughs> Necro. Oh, but you're able to shift and morph your, your face and your body and everything. I so think anyone can do that. It's just sort of forbidden magic. Um, I, huh? What did Taylor say? Oh, I said, I think she anyone is... all can do it. forbidden. Yeah, I think so. Kind of like, you know, how Alder puppeted the... You know, it's... I think anyone can practice that, but it's just outlawed by the Hague. I, that's my uh, understanding. Course. I don't yeah. actually know. So, it is dark magic, yeah. At first, I somehow thought dodging was how you, like, Shift. was what a spree shifter was. Yeah. And then you explained it, like, my parents dodged the military, and I was like, oh. Oh, yeah, I guess yeah. you guys, like, because we, Amalia and I really talked about it, and we got to talk about it with, like, Steve and Elliot and stuff, and you guys were less involved because it was just, like, mostly these one-on-one -on -one scenes, so I, that totally makes sense that you guys had less of an understanding. Also, I went... I got like one scene with Amalia, like yeah. one, and you guys literally did. with that lobster. And I, at the I, wedding. At the yes. wedding, but you, well, in the, the pizza wedding, parlor. Also, <laughs> the pizza one parlor. One of my favorite scenes of all times is so. This is High Atlantic. Yeah, the pizza, oh, um, the pizza parlor. This is High parlor. Yes. Yeah, man. Guys, yeah, should we take That's questions from Instagram Live? Yeah. Do we guys okay? We want to answer some questions. I'm turning you guys upside down. Yes. Okay. Uh, we got 1,200 people currently watching. And guys, we, what what are your questions? What do you want to know? I should have worn a bra as well. <laughs> nah, I'm not wearing a bra. I have a bra, and it's okay. Nah. Must be the. Okay. So someone else's theory. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, here's the theory, guys. Rael's mom is the head of the spree. She's alive. This is a season two secret. That's what someone's theory is. Uh, and if we could play another character, who would it be? Sending love from New Zealand. This is Corey Tiamo, I think. So if we could play another character, what who could it be? Like if we could play one of our characters. Yeah, who would it be? Ooh, that's hard. Oh, like a different character in the show? Yeah, if we, could, if we, we could play yeah. that. I would want to play Silla. Silla. I would say Scylla, yeah. too. That seems like oh, yeah. such a fun <laughs> character. I want to yeah. kiss Taylor. Makes sense. Okay, yeah, I'd say Scylla. So that was kind of like a group. I love me. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what, Demetria? What's your reason? What? I, said, well, I would want to be Rayel. That um, the mystique behind her her uh, rebellion, mm -hmm. but capacity to love if she really decides to. Plus the healing aspect. It's so funny for somebody to not want to be involved in what the military is supposed to represent, but be doing it the whole time. Like you're you're literally a walking, talking enigma, and the two of you together, being you know so opposite in in your convictions but being so together because of the yin and yang of what you are is just really really cool that's a great description yeah <laughs> elliot did a phenomenal yeah, job I right before I had it too, so i'd like to revisit that thanks <laughs> so, i did I, it, I did an interview on on after buzz and they asked me that exactly same question and at first i was like who would i want to be who would i want to i want to be and i thought it was such an interesting and difficult question yeah but i have to say I love playing Alder so much. Yeah, I don't think so I could good. see myself as anyone else. Is that really bad? No, no not I, at I, all. I, I really, I relate. And also I respect you guys' uh, performances and like your versions of your characters in the sense that you kind of 
like I feel like we're all grown in to be our characters and also totally. we know that our performances have influenced the writing yeah like, they know when we can't like yeah. they know what they like to see us do and then they make yeah. us do more of it mm-hmm. yeah that's the beauty uh, about tv you know when it's such yeah. a creative process because they get to see each of us as an individual and see our strength and as we went everything was kind of written towards our person not necessarily our personalities but what we were bringing to the character more tailored to us that was just so beautiful to see how the arches went and as you go along the series i just felt like everybody was just getting into their character was like living it more and more and more just because we were just fed by this creative group of people including ourselves and, yeah. and that is a beautiful thing about tv that's, and that's going to be wonderful time. going into season two because now they have yeah. all of season one to yeah, to mm. bring literally see what we bring season one the cliffhangers <laughs> i cannot there's a lot i, literally, I, I feel bad so for bad. i wish it was everyone like watching right that it was airing so we could talk about it we should do this tomorrow or Day after. Yes. Yeah, the day after. No, no, no. After, after the after, after. Oh yeah. Okay. So maybe like Friday, Friday or Thursday. Thursday. Yeah. Well, can Friday. I just say? Yeah. Can I just say? I'd, I think it would be an amazing. I would so much want to do Abigail too. Also, just because to have that. I, I was thinking with, about that too. Because oh. it's and it's a pressure I've I've so never understood, and it's and yeah. The, the br- Oh, we, uh-huh. Molly, we lost you. Say again. We missed you for a second. Uh-oh. Breaking up. Oh. Are we all frozen? <laughs> oh, we were for a second. Is anybody else here? Like Amalia, but... Oh, there she is. Okay. We lost her for a second. Yeah, we lost her for a second. We missed the last thing you said. Oh, no. Molly, you're going to change my... But this is a good idea. We should do this this for the finale. Yes. Yeah. But like Dimitri said, after Hulu. Yeah, after Hulu. So, so, so if you guys, yeah, if you guys want to chat point. on we Friday, do this on Friday. Yeah. yeah I'm Friday. Um. Okay. Someone. Okay. Someone else has yeah. another great question. Izzy Kane says, "Each of you, what's your favorite line from your character?" Ashley, I like when we say T- Tally, shut up. That's pretty funny. Um, oh, yeah, no, shut it's up, so Tally. beautiful. Yeah, it's so beautiful. It's really funny. I also <laughs> like. The timing in that is. Oh my gosh, you're amazing. And the fact that you were so nervous about having to be the comedic relief. You're so good. <laughs> yeah. So good, Jess. So, yes, I, I love when we when we're together. I love you guys with all that. Yeah. yeah. Ah, so true. Yeah, yeah. It's the naive need, leading the naive. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Demetria, that's right? that's actually that's what it's like now. on set. Absolutely. The naive There's leading the naive. Happening. Yeah. I think I, mine would probably be the Nene horse line. Yeah, that's the <laughs> dumb noodling Nene horse. Dish. Like you dumb noodling Nene horse from a dumb noodling nobody. I died. Like, who thinks of that? I love Scylla's They Have that's Lobster. Hilarious. I also like when I call Libba cute though. Or she's she was kind of, oh, yeah, yeah, I thought she was kind of cute. Oh, that, I thought that cute. was funny. Type emerging. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like when Alder says that um, whiskey is the only thing that humans got right. I love that one too. That's a great <laughs> line. I, I could not believe that you said before that that food was. Was it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like, you don't what? eat. Wait, I what? Don't eat. I actually I don't have, have to eat anymore. Bitties, my bitties eat for me, they yeah. do everything for me. I mean, it's a blessing. Except really? Except for you. <laughs> oh, I missed it's that. Beltane. Beltane. Yep. Dang. Yeah, they still do that for you. I Ashley, still do the what are you drinking, before. Ashley? <laughs> I, think, um, I think my favorite, I'm torn. Yeah, it's either makes me bitch. proud. Uh-huh. Or that incredibly impossible line they gave me for which... <laughs> Windstrike, ladies, the first piece of military cannon you get when entering basic training. Windstrike is that a- speech that that killed me. Yeah, I don't even know. Found the formation something something. Yeah. Yeah. What? Who talks like that? Oh, you had the hardest lines, and then Jess had some yeah. really hard lines too with her it accent. Not a line, though, it was like a monologue every time. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember, 
like, uh, what was it? Episode two, uh, three a.m. and we were in the in the rough room, and you were like, <laughs> I think, and you never do this. Oh. <laughs> Navy or something, no, didn't you? In the Air- <laughs> was it the Air Force? Oh yeah, it was the Air Force. I would also quote a mother tongue, but I have forgotten Wait, everything. I it is so that. difficult. I mean, really? Season two is gonna see us, I think, learn all of that. Yes. I think. I'm yeah. gonna- oh, a lot, of, a lot more mother tongue coming by the man who made the languages he did came of thrones i mean he's like and it's an art it, it's an art form it's the most it's probably one of the most challenging things i've had to do so besides crazy. play over but um mother tongue is pretty like out there so we'll all, all be able to put on our resumes that we speak mother tongue <gasps> yes Useful. i really or, hope we all get the chance to speak mother tongue i hope i hope that we get a language class that american isn't my, what is my Oh, I said I hope that one of our, our classes, like, you know, as we're going on a war college, I'm I'm assuming that um we will get to do um classes, you know, actual yeah, classes. <laughs> yeah. War college, I'm assuming you would have to take classes, right? Like actual classes. So I'm hoping that we would be able to take language yeah. if we go into war college. Yeah. Ashley, enough. I about, know what, what you're about, thinking. No, I know what you're uh, thinking. I know exactly what you're thinking at this very moment. And I'm coming I'm for you. I'm not saying a word. Yeah, because you're like me. And I say too much. You think we'll get animals? Ooh. Animals? <gasps> I would love to get an animal. Like Garrett had a bird. Like what if we all had like... like Shoddy Hedwig. Birds. Shoddy okay, Hedwig. No, the budgie bird owl. They're very difficult to work with. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> Jess is like they're divas. That's I... all of our phone time. <laughs> oh, we oh, s- like <laughs> someone else pointed out a great line of Amalia's. Is I confess I am a witch. That was a great line. Yeah. That yes, was that funny. Was I was cackling. It's either that. I like what you've done with the place. <laughs> what <laughs> what you've done with the place. Patronizing. We, we laughed so, so much. In, it was so. But it's either um, I confess I am a witch or thank you ever so much for lunch. That was a good um, one. That are my two favorites. But then, I mean, I feel like it wouldn't, it's, there has to be an honor to um, to the uh, Scylla Riel reunion, not so much reunion. Mm-hmm. Um, and like, uh, I can't quote it exactly, but isn't it something like I, um, I never wanted to hurt you like i never meant oh to i love that i like that line for a very you different reason yeah me when you walk out taylor and you say we all have to go sometime like the line before amalia's mm. that like led to that one mm-hmm. i literally was like <clears throat> that was yeah. such a hard That's scene right. to shoot because uh i could hear i think Demetri, you walk in as i'm walking out in both of the scenes that we shot that were really hard I, I can't remember, but yeah, it just as I was being pulled out, because they pulled down and they the the stunt ladies would set me down in the little corridor right outside, and um, I would just kind of be sitting there and rocking, and I was like covering my ears, and I could just hear her Amalia screaming bloody murder, and it just like the chills went up my spine, and like she was screaming my name, screaming no, screaming please, and it was just like oh. the pain though, it was so. It was that day, like, some of those, that, what we felt in those scenes were just, like, too real. Oh, yeah. A little bit too real. Yeah. Like, we had to, we were hugging it out, crying afterwards, and we were trying to shake it off, and the directors but were hugging us, and yeah. You was, know, Taylor, you know what us. scene was freaking, okay, before I say that, the one with Libba dying. Oh, oh man. Um, yeah. yeah. Demetria had to hold me. Like, I was so, like, connected to Sarah to where I, like, visualized Sarah. And I remember Demetria was like, I'm a G, and you almost made me cry. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, that Demetria was hard. Demetria was like, and I'm a G. Were Sarah, you, were you like, fall back in her arms and you're crying? <laughs> 
that. I was, everyone cried over Loba's death. And if you didn't, you're stone cold. Even Sarah. Even Sarah. Like, that, like, as she came out of it being her lost take, it was, you see it. I mean, she is a cool cat. Oh, Sarah doesn't cry over nothing. That that whole time. Like, to hear (laughs) that. First off, you, first off, don't breathe. How about that? We don't need to see your heart. We don't need to see your heart. First off, don't breathe. Sarah. Second off, don't cry or snot. Like, <laughs> Ashley was going in. So I'm sitting here like, you got a scar on your eye. Man up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how Sarah did it, but kudos to both of you guys. Man, you, you, that you, scene you, was yeah. amazing. Yeah, you got me. And, um... Guys. Honestly, petition to bring Sarah back as Libba's ghost in season two. I say that. I'll, I'll do I know. I'll do my best as a necro to get her back. I was going to say, Amalia, this is your job. <laughs> oh, we lost them. Oh, no. Not the bad connection. <sighs> well, okay. At least I still have you guys. How do I turn this around? Can I flip this around? Um, well, while we wait for them to return. Um, thank you guys for coming and hanging out on this live. I know you guys have been asking about it for a long time. And we're all so busy without being busy at all somehow. Oh no, it closed. It's reconnected. But, um, honestly, yeah, facts. I'm all your Hi, Catherine. I love you. Um... But we're just so, so grateful for all of, you, all of you guys to just come show up and, and hang out with us. Because, you know, we were like, I don't know if anyone would just want to watch us talk over each other and be excited and drink. And we figured most of y'all might be doing the same thing. So we <laughs> thought we'd all do it together. Tonight, is that a horrible thing? Okay, we got him back. How do I flip this? There we go. But can we do this on Friday after the finale? Yes. 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 Where did yes. Demetria go? And Friday would be the best for me too, because I'm traveling to Norway. Oh yes. my gosh! Okay. Okay. I'm traveling to the living room. There we go. There's everybody's so pretty faces. Organize this, can we all like set a time in advance and then do yeah. this? I would love that. We'll How long will be in, like we did this one? We'll we'll yeah together. Is, awesome. Yeah. Yeah. That works yeah. for me. Okay. But you know what? Season two, girls. Woo! <laughs> I love you all. Can we all uh, have whatever drink that we have right now, real quick, okay. just to get like coffee, water. So either Thursday or Friday, coffee. you guys, we're gonna we're gonna get together and Three, do a live two, again after the finale. Cheers! <laughs> Cheers! Cheers! Okay. Season two, girls. Yay. Get your screen caps. <laughs> Oh, yeah, what a classic. Is it shiny? Yeah, what a good it, line. But is it? But is it? Is it? But is no, it? Taylor said it's like an inch from her JJ. I'll check. <laughs> that shit is shiny as hell, bro. Silla <laughs> made sure of that. You're funny. <laughs> exactly. Cheers, girls. I love you for Thank you for watching, Taylor. Love you guys. Okay, talk Bye. very soon. See you on Friday, everyone. See you Bye. guys soon. Bye. 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 <laughs> Just so y'all know, I had to Google how to do a Zoom meeting, and we wanted to do this like an hour and a half ago, and it just wasn't working out because I suck. We were all really techni- technologically challenged. Um, but... We love you guys so much. Thank you for coming and joining us. And it's because of you that we are um, we're getting a second opportunity to, to create for you guys. And um, thank you for everything that you've done. I'm not going to cry again because we did that like three times this morning. But from the bottoms of our, our hearts, you know, I, they're just that there really isn't, there really isn't words. So, um... We couldn't breathe when we heard the news this morning. And y'all, I woke up at 5 a.m. to uh, to do the morning show in Canada on Global News. And um, 
I just see y'all going stupid, going crazy on my timeline, and you're all sending me this. And yeah, it was leaked. Um, it wasn't supposed to be released earlier, I don't think. Uh, I think some of you actually translated it from Portuguese, and that's how you found out. <laughs> so, uh, kudos to you guys for being such great detectives. Um, but yeah, then we did get a call this morning, and um, within like half an hour, 45 minutes of that, it was up on deadline. Motherland was announcing it. Uh, so we basically found out when you guys did. They just give us, they gave us like a little sliver of time to, to cool our jets so that we could come talk to you. Um, but yeah, we didn't know until um, like half an hour before it was, before it was announced and before we put up all the posts. So uh, we knew as much as you guys did, but uh, they've apparently known for days and they were super excited to tell us and yeah. Um, and yeah, great. So all of us girls found out this morning, and we're so excited to share this news with you, and we will see you so soon for season two. Love you guys. Bye!